What's up everybody, Typical Gamer here with your daily GTA 5 news and today I'm coming at you with 12 new confirmed facts for GTA Online and let me tell you, a lot of these are very interesting and they answer a lot of your questions that you've been asking me so be sure to stay tuned to this episode. As always, if you enjoyed the video be sure to press that like button and to subscribe for more daily top notch GTA 5 videos. To start, the character menu while playing will enable little customizations such as mask changes and stuff like that. You can own just one property at a time, but you can move to a better house once you have enough money. Now again, this only applies to GTA Online, and in single player you'll probably be able to own all the houses that you can afford. You can customize your home with expensive wood, fancy accessories, big TVs, and more. So house customization or apartment or property customization in GTA Online is confirmed, so you can definitely deck out your place and make it look a lot different than your friends. You can actually install a tracking device in your car, so in case somebody steals your car, you can track it down, kill them, and take what's rightfully yours back. Now this is from the Rockstar website, and GTA Online introduces a new spin on traditional character creation with the hereditary based creation system. Select your character's appearance by choosing your parent's heritage, then use the gene dominance meter to dial in which parent your appearance favors more. Additionally, you'll customize your character's daily activities, everything from family time to legal work and sports to couch potato hours, all have an impact on your character's appearance and skill set, and you can always rank up your skill stats more via gameplay. As part of the collector's edition package, you'll get Nico Bellic along with both Claude and Misty from Grand Theft Auto 3 to use as parent options within the character creation system. Quick races where you could just mark the finish line on the map and then you could race are confirmed. There's apparently going to be very good handling of the cars in GTA 5 and it's going to have a racing game feel almost. So coming back there's going to be lap racing, the classic GTA race with the guns, rally racing which is a new one where you could have a co-driver where they could either direct where you're going or even call in airstrikes and stuff like that and more. So in GTA Online you could actually improve your gun skill, stamina and more making you work harder to get those awesome skills up. So those are around 700 missions that were confirmed, you can replay them all. At the end of each mission, there's a table of results which is similar to the Ballad of Gay Tony that lists how much money you made and all sorts of interesting details. In GTA Online, you could also hire coordinators to help you drive, spies, drivers so you can sit in the passenger seat, and more such as bodyguards or mercenaries. So that's it for today guys, that's 12 new facts that I kind of just wanted to throw at you quick which I thought were really interesting, especially the customization of apartments and property and the properties that you can own and stuff like that. If you're a little confused on how that's going to work, check out my Q&A Sunday that I released yesterday, I'm going to put a link in the description and that will tell you my theory on how the apartments will work and how everybody can actually own the same apartment. My question for you is, which one of these 12 facts is your favorite? Leave a comment below and let me know what you think. As always, be sure to press that like button if you enjoyed today's video and to subscribe if you haven't for more great GTA 5 videos. As you may or may not know, I'm hosting a huge GTA 5 contest and today is another winner that's going to be announced for 85,000 subscribers, which I want to thank you all very much for the support and now I'm going to announce the winner. So drum roll please. And the winner of today's GTA 5 prize, which is a GTA 5 t-shirt is... Thomas, who goes by Creative Rhino on Twitter. So Thomas, if you're listening, please contact me so I can get you that t-shirt and congratulations. If you want in on a chance to win possibly daily prizes as we are growing really fast, then be sure to check out the contest in the description below and enter. I'm also hosting a live stream right when this video comes out, so if you want to check it out, go to twitch.tv slash typicalgamer, follow that channel so that you know when I'm streaming, and also be sure to chat with all your fellow GTA 5 enthusiasts. I'll be letting you know how to play with me in that chat, but to know when I'm streaming in the future, be sure to follow me on Twitter and like me on Facebook, which you can find in the description below. As always, be sure to check out the next daily video tomorrow at 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific, and 11 p.m. UK time. Thanks for watching. I hope you have an awesome day and peace out.